Hello everyone, this is Senor Irvin and I am giving you a quick tutorial on something called Cam Scanner. As you can see on the screen here, hopefully you can see on the screen here, uh, we have an app and it's called Cam Scanner. And if you don't have this app, you are allowed to go ahead and download it from the iTunes store. Um, so go ahead and do that. Uh, again, it's called Cam Scanner. It's a free app. Once you get Cam Scanner, what you're going to do is you're going to just double click it. So I'm going to double click mine right now. And you aren't going to have all of these documents here the first time that you go through it, but you actually are probably going to be able to set up an account, and I would definitely set up an account because it'll save all of your files okay, that you end up creating here. Uh, what we're going to do basically with Cam Scanner is turn pictures into PDF files. That will allow you to go ahead and submit items really quickly to Schoology and also allow the teachers to see the items really quickly. Then what's super cool about Cam Scanner is that you can also quickly modify the pictures so that they're better you know so that if let's say you had some writing on a page and you wanted to go ahead and show the writing sometimes when you take the picture with your uh, regular camera it doesn't work out very well so let's go ahead and do that right now I'm pulling up this thing right here and I'm gonna press the camera function here and oh look at that oh hey this is the when he was a baby alright so now I'm gonna go ahead and point it down at my document here so I can just show you kinda how this works and all we're gonna do is we're gonna press the camera button here okay I'm going to go ahead and press the camera button. Boom. And now it just took the picture. Okay, so now I'm going to flip this back over so we can kind of see what, what's going on here. And the picture is down here at the bottom left, so I'm going to click it. Okay, and so let's go ahead and click it. Let's press done. And let's see what happens. Okay, let's press done. It's loading up the image. Okay, so now what's happening here is it's saying, what do you actually want me to go ahead and take the picture of? So I can move these things. You notice how I'm moving them right here? Ooh. See? and basically put it around the part that I actually wrote so if you you know you have some extra part of your paper or something I'm just gonna put it up this part here then you can just move these little uh, dots here to to uh, surround only the part that you wrote right so let's press next step look at that okay so something has happened number one it's modified the size of the document right but it also enhanced the image if you didn't like the enhancement you can just click the button that says original so let me click back original and it just doesn't enhance it so much I'm gonna press auto enhance and it enhances a little bit you notice what it done here is it kind of lightens up the picture if you didn't like that again just press original back at original you can also mess around with any of the settings like over here on this area uh, to be able to saturate the light move more light in there whatever it might be I don't usually mess with any of that I just press next step oh actually let me go back to that picture because I should have flipped that picture. Let me see if I can go ahead and edit it. Yeah, I can right here. This little ar uh, arrow right here, I can actually flip the picture, I think. Yeah! So now it just edited the picture in the right direction. Because you know your cameras, they do all kinds of weird things. They invert images. They do images upside down. That way when you submit this image to whoever your teacher is, they'll actually be able to see it in this direction. And it will be ready to go. So I'm going to go to press back. Okay, and then now what we're going to do is we're going to say, okay, now what do we do with this? How do we turn it into Schoology? You click on the image itself, you put it in this area here, and there's these three dots over here. So let's click the three dots. And then there's a button called, right in the middle of the page, open in. I'm going to click open in, and it says, what kind of file do you want me to send? Always send PDF files because they're little, they're small, and they load quickly. Okay, they won't take a bunch of space. And then let's go ahead and select, oh, I don't know what I just selected. I don't know if I selected anything. Oh, I selected Notability. Way to go, Urban. So, uh, actually, what I want to select is, um, I wanted to select Schoology, which is easy to go ahead and do. I'm going to click the three little dots, see if it lets me do it again. Open in, PDF file, and you can do Notability, by the way. You can edit your images and do those kinds of things. But let's go ahead and just click Schoology, and then yours would go and say, Hey, what assignment do you want me to submit this to? And it'll go through the same process you guys normally go through. If you have any questions, let Senor Irvin know. You can download it anytime. Adios. Hasta la pasta.